Ladies and gentlemen, the internet can be a dangerous place. A man from Ayrshire, Scotland, one Matthew Bell, a sexual predator who directed rapes and attacks via live streams, is now behind bars for nine years. This man pled guilty to no less than five charges spanning between 2013 to 2017. The man was involved in directing people via live streams to essentially rape children for him, for money, for literal pennies. His property was raided, finding a hard drive containing images of child sexual exploitation. This is a truly evil and vile human being, ladies and gentlemen. This comes amidst information on an app called TikTok being investigated due to reports of predatory behaviour targeting children ranging from grooming inappropriate comments and attempting to produce pornographic nude imagery. TikTok is owned by a Chinese company named ByteDance and the company has in the past been fined $5.7 million by the FTC for violating children's privacy and has been blocked in India after a court ruled that the app could expose kids to predators, pornography, cyberbullying and abuse. The UK is now investigating TikTok for potential GDPR violations and the app's parent company could face more fines, up to £17.9 million. I mean, fucking wow, you make a social media platform and you don't even bother trying to protect the people that use it. I mean, what the actual fuck are you playing at? Ladies and gentlemen, I cannot stress enough how important it is to educate your children on the dangers of such platforms. Such platforms where people engage in social luring and social engineering. Behaviour that we see from such criminal organisations as Zymer Tracks to draw in the young and the naive. Ladies and gentlemen, teach your kids to be aware of these threats and predators and to be able to block and report and ignore wherever applicable. And I know what I'm about to say will sound awful, but if someone is able to defend themselves from such people and are seen to be defending themselves from such people, then the abusers will simply move on and try and find easier targets. And I know that's pretty bad, but in all honesty, you don't want these things to happen to the people you know. I've been Stu Dog and I'll catch you next time.